I'll probably look crusty AF, but that is because I am super stressed. Um, I'm going through the worst right now. So I'm going to go to 7-Eleven, try to get something, maybe some snacks and some water. I don't know, some change. And then, yeah, so I will tell you guys what I'm going through throughout the day. But for now, we are just going to see what it is that I'm looking for in 7-Eleven and then we'll figure things out together. Yeah. bus station I'm waiting for the bus to go to Cheng Chiang Seng and yeah we <laughs> getting to this bus and going to the golden triangle Chiang Sen oh Chiang Chiang Sen Chiang Sen so the blue bus is going to leave at I hope you guys can hear me it's going to leave at 9 a.m. and right now it was leaving so I had to come rushing because I did not want any drama darling I do not want to be left behind I just don't want any of that I don't want trouble today all I want is my things to go smoothly and so far so good which is super exciting I will tell you on my way where I'm going guys so yeah Okay, so I am leaving Thailand, going to Lao because I overstayed my visa, meaning that I'm now in Thailand illegally. So I have to go fix my papers and that means leaving the country. And I know it's confusing because I went to the immigration not so long ago for my 90 day check in, but somehow I did not realize that I have, oh, it's just a lot that's going on guys. <laughs> So I am very nervous. We are almost in Chiang Sen. In Chiang, in Chiang Sen. Uh, I'm about five minutes away from there. So I'm a little nervous. I don't know what's gonna happen, but yeah. So I haven't updated you guys on what is really happening, but I will do that as soon as I get everything sorted out. But it's a long story that I short I, I i don't even need to live the story but we are here now so let's go I will tell you the story about why. Anyway, um, Thailand cities or towns really look the same. You think that I'm in Metai, but I'm really not. I'm like an hour away from them. So, yeah, now let's go in the full um, immigration. The immigration here, and I'm afraid we have to go to Subflua or something. So, I'm gonna go there, and I am very frustrated. I'm very angry. <laughs> But it is what it is. So now I'm in a. I don't know what this is, but I'm in something. So I will talk to you guys when I feel better. Hey, bitch, I can beat. I can beat fantasy. I can tell you that. Tell you that beat, beat energy. Hey, bitch, I can beat, 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 Hey bitch, I can be fantasy, be fantasy, be fantasy, be fantasy, be fantasy, be fantasy, pussy juicy, mini mate. I can tell you got me, then tell you got me, tell you got me, tell you got me. I can tell you got me, then tell you got me, tell you got me. So I am at the immigration and I'm heading to Lao. Um, I will tell you guys the reason um later, but for now I want to get my life sorted out and then I will be with you guys shortly later. 
so now I am going to Lao. I am so excited for this. It is amazing. It is super cute. Wow. Okay, let me rush before this. Hey, 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 hey. Oi, oi, oi. Oh, wait, no, that's Afrikaans. I don't know what language it's speaking now. But yeah. Sorted out, and then um, I'll be oh well, I guess that's my visit to Laos, or is it Lao? Because I mean, yeah, I'm disappointed because I wanted to go explore, but then. Because the English is very limited, I just went from them to like departure immediately and it was like, child, why don't I just stay for like an hour or something and then visit and do whatever, but okay, it is what it is. So now we are heading to, uh, back to Chiang Rai, Thailand. Oh, okay. And Galeela was wrong, but yeah. Now we're going back to... To Thailand and guys I'm actually really pissed and I'm gonna tell you all about it when I get to, to Thailand. So yeah let's go <laughs> What was going on this week? I don't know what you know. Anyway, so um, I am going to do a story time about what I have been until today. I couldn't sleep, I couldn't focus, I had work to do, and I had things that I had to deal with in my own personal time. You know what I mean? And this is the time where I learned that I don't regret any decision that I made. Um, even though I was super stressed the entire month, thinking, Am I making the right decision? Am I going to regret this? But guess what? I do not regret it. So I will do a story time and I will tell you guys what is it what it is that I went through today and this couple this couple of uh, weeks. So yeah. Now let me enjoy my uh, Oreo cheesecake and my tea because you know I love tea. So yeah. So guys, the minute you start getting used to Indawar, getting used to like Thailand and everything and how everything works, you no longer think like a foreigner, you start thinking more like a local. And it's not really such a good thing for the people who are living here because you know, they get to make a living out of, you know, swindling uh, tourists and whatever. And then you are from, well, you're not from here, but you're used to staying here. So you know the right prices. Because 
let's be honest with me i know the right prices because i have tight rates and just jay i know so it's very hard for you to send me i wanted a i wanted to get a car to not a car a taxi to well it is a car but yeah well i wanted to get a taxi to Maasai and there's a blue van that is that costs around 500 baht it costs five, oh no 50 baht sorry it costs around 50 baht and i wanted to take that ride sorry i'm a bit sweaty and once you live in thailand you'll get to understand why people sweat so much because this country is hot and I also don't have a a tripod because I did not think that I will be vlogging today because of the things that I was going through and I was super stressed the entire week and morning it was just crazy for me but uh, I'm thankful and grateful that everything went well you know I'd like to thank Mudimu Libadimu my god and my ancestors for watching out for your girl yes mm -hmm. so if you want you can go in there but i'm not gonna do it because child and those dogs over there always attack me oh my goodness Everybody is always talking about. Hmm. I can't believe how sunny it is in Burma. I mean, well, it could be Burma because that is Lao. That is Burma. Lao is a bit shadowy, while Burma is a bit sunny. So this is a golden triangle. The water is not appeasing at all. Um, I was that side in Lao, and yeah. So the red shade is Lao, the golden shade is Thailand, and the green shade is Myanmar. Myanmar used to be called Burma. So if you hear me say Burma, it's because it used to be called Burma. Yeah. So this is the infamous golden triangle yep 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 <laughs>